Life is like a game of chess. Now why would I say that? Because every single move that you make is working for you or against you. So although as a young person you may not have quite decided on what your true passion in life is, every single thing that you do is going to make a difference. I know growing up and starting my first jobs and paying and putting myself through university degrees on my own that I discovered that if I gave my very best to my employer, I was rewarded accordingly. Now that doesn't always mean higher wages, but it does mean more responsibilities. And the more responsible we are and the greater we give back to the company, the greater our advancement in our personal and professional growth can be. I know I changed companies many, many times, even within one industry, because my theory was that if I gave it my best, and then I gathered as much information as I possibly could, until there was nothing else to learn within that company, and then I gave my notice and moved on to a new company, so I could escalate my learning curve in a very fast track away. So with that game of chess, plan out your moves carefully and know and understand that your goals and desired outcomes will be different, particularly in every decade. One of my favorite books is by Gail Sheehy, and she wrote it many years ago, called uh, Passages and Predictable Adult Life Crises. Your trying 20s, your catch 30s, your forlorn 40s. There are a lot of challenges in life. And some people say you can't have it all. However, I don't think that that personally is true. I believe now, after decades of m fantastic learning curves, that I do have it all. I'm a global expert known for my image, etiquette, manners, communication, and leadership coaching. And I've had people all over the world hire me for my expertise. So if you have a passion for whatever it is that you feel is your calling in life, give it your very best and live in abundance and always have that huge quest for knowledge. Gloria Starr, the global expert of choice.